<laughs> you know, that's a, that's a tough question. I don't know what some people, um, what some people do. Um, I had to overcome um, a lot of fears uh, that I had uh, becoming an astronaut. Um, you know, I, I was afraid of, uh, I was claustrophobic, afraid of close spaces. Um, I, I was definitely afraid of the water because I wasn't a good swimmer. And, um, and, uh, and I was afraid of heights. Uh, but not not flying. I love I love flying, um, and so I had to overcome those fears. And um, you know, I think the only way you overcome some of those fears is by actually being put in those situations, and and learning yourself how to cope with those those stressful um, environments and those stressful conditions. Um, and so. Uh, what we do, we train, we, we do safety survival, do survival training, we train in extreme environments, and, and we fly, you know, um, 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 uh, in jet, jet aircraft so that we multitask and we communicate, and we're in stressful situations, and sometimes when we're even in training, you'll have anomalies happen, and then you have to react to those um anomalies and I think it's a matter of uh, practice it's a matter of um, constantly training uh, that uh, makes you more and more comfortable in those situations so that you're calm so that when it does come time that a real situation arises you can keep your wits about you and you can communicate uh, you can act as a, a a good team member to try to uh, psych out what the problem is as quickly as possible um, in, in order to uh, in order to save yourself and save the crew I, I think it just comes with practice and experience that's a very very good question and um, more and more as we go further and further out in space, and not just low Earth orbit, um, astronauts have to rely on each other. Just like if you saw the movie The Martian, uh, Rocky was all alone on the, on the planet, and he had to really rely on his own skills because of that time delay. You don't have that immediate response from the ground. Sometimes you might have to wait 30 minutes or more in order to get a response to one of your questions. And so uh, more and more, the astronauts have to be able to train themselves, to rapidly learn, to learn from each other, work together as a team, but to solve the problems on their own when they're in those conditions, especially when you're that far away from Earth.